Hi, good morning. It's Jane from the Vineyards Wellness Center and Spa. Um, if you don't know me, I'm the spa supervisor at the spa, and I'm also a licensed esthetician. So since everybody's stuck at home and you can't come in for your services um, and get a facial from our wonderful service providers, I'm going to take you through a very simple, uh, basic AM skincare routine with um, using all the products that we carry at the spa that you can you can come pick up at any time. Um, I'm ready to go. I've got my headband on. I've got my vineyards bathrobe on. Um, this is my first YouTube video, so bear with me. But I'm going to take you through something that you can do every morning, um, and it's great for kind of any skin type. Um, so I'm going to start with our hydropeptide, which is our new line that I'm really excited about, the cleansing gel from them. This is a everyday basic cleanser that you can use twice a day. It's good for any skin type. Um, it won't dry, it won't strip, and I love it because it smells like cucumbers. So I do about maybe a pump, and I'm gonna be shooting this video at my vanity versus um, at my bathroom sink so I can record this for you guys. So it has a nice little lather, and usually what I do is I get it a little bit wet. I have a little bit of water here with me so I can keep it wet. And what you wanna do is, I think what a lot of people do when they cleanse is they rush through it. You know, they kind of put it on and then rinse it right off. And what I tell everybody is it doesn't give the ingredients enough time to really do anything. So you can do a little bit of massage, make sure you really get in all of those little crooks and crannies. And this stuff smells so good. And we're gonna be using this in our facials at the Wellness Center. So, a little more water. So it does lather a little bit, but nothing, um, nothing stripping or too abrasive. It's very, very gentle. And then what I'm gonna use to follow up is, um, many people use Clarisonic brushes. This is a little brush that I love because it's actually silicone. It's very, very gentle, gives a mild exfoliation, and silicone is great because it doesn't harbor bacteria. So um, very gentle, and it has like a little sonic vibration. So I like to go in and do a little exfoliation, nothing crazy, over the lips a little bit, get all that dead skin off. Very, very gentle, down into the neck. And you'll see I'm getting a little bit pink. I tend to be a little sensitized. And then I'm gonna use a hot towel. And said so normally I would just be at my bathroom sink, but for video purposes, I'm gonna to towel this all off. I always recommend um, white towels because you can bleach them and keep them clean. This is just a nice, soft little chamois cloth. These are great if you want to do a little steam. I think they sell these at Amazon for like a pack of 10 for 12 bucks. They're great. So I'm just gently toweling off the cleanser. Now I don't do a double cleanse in the morning because I don't have any makeup on and I just need something gentle. At night, I do a little bit more in depth because I've got a full face of makeup on. So now we're gonna go and we're gonna do our toner. So my favorite toner is the pre-treatment toner from Hydropeptide. Again, this is ugh, smells delicious. It smells like cucumbers. It's very fresh. Um, and the toners nowadays versus the toners that we all sort of grew up with um, or you may remember them being called astringents. I think everyone remembers Sea Breeze, the witch hazel, that strong alcohol smell that you would get. This is gonna be very conditioning. So instead of, think of it, instead of it taking things away from the skin, it's gonna be adding good ingredients to the skin. So I'm out of my little cotton round, so I'm gonna use a little cotton ball today, and you don't need a lot, just a little bit. And the key with toners, besides it kind of getting off all the, the gunk, is it's going to balance the pH of your skin. So after you've just cleansed, you kind of want to rebalance. Now, a lot of people with toners go a little bit too rough. They're really rough and aggressive. You don't want to do that. You kind of want to pat it in, be very gentle. It's kind of like you're adding something back to the skin. You don't want to sit there and rub too hard, especially this one because it's so um, conditioning. It's got, I can read some of the 
Um, it's got collagen boosting peptides, brightening extract, and orange stem cell extract. So very, very conditioning. And it smells so good. I would bathe in it if I could. So all done. Then what we're going to do is we're going to add our daily serum. Now, you know, there's a million serums out there that do a million different things for me. Um, my focus is on brightening my skin. I was born and raised in Florida. I have lots of sun damage from years and years of not wearing my sunscreen, which we all know is a no-no. So the serum that I'm going to use is the Luma C Pro. It is a vitamin C serum, which is an antioxidant-based serum. So it's going to brighten and lighten my pigmentation, but also protect me from future sun damage. So with a serum, um, they're concentrated. Unlike a moisturizer or a cream, it's gonna be a much more um, condensed version of those active ingredients that you want. So you don't need a lot. So I'm gonna do a little, kind of like a little green pea size amount. And I always recommend when you're using your serums or your products, um, use your fingertips. You don't wanna wipe it all over your hands and then all over your face because you're wasting so much product that way. So I do with my tippy tippy fingertips and I kind of, you wanna go down into the neck and then just gently spread. And you can do like a little facial massage, make sure you're getting in there. So all that product is now on your face and not all on your hands that have absorbed everything. You know, I still recommend a good hand cream. You want your hands moisturized or always rub it on the back of your hands because that's what, where we start to show our age. So very simple serum. Then I like to go in with a little bit of eye cream. So the one I'm using is the Hydropeptide Eye Authority. This one is great for dark circles, puffiness, and fine lines. So kind of your catch-all. Um, and again, with an eye, uh, eye cream or an eye serum, very, very little. Okay. And then everybody, I think everybody knows this, but if you don't, you want to use your ring finger. So the reason why is this is your weakest finger and the skin around your eyes is so delicate and so thin. You don't want to tug or pull. So I do this, I kind of mix it together and then I just lightly pat and I like to go around the eye with a little bit. And then I just do a gentle, gentle, super light little massage, move some of that lymphatic drainage. Maybe you wake up in the morning with puffy eyes, you had too much salt or an extra glass of wine and you're holding some of that fluid in your eyes. You just wanna kind of gently move that out and around. And that's always a nice base for your makeup too, to make sure your eyes are nice and hydrated so your makeup goes on, it doesn't get all crepey and sticky. Next, we're gonna move on to, this is one of my favorites. This is the Nimni Day Cream. Um, so this has amino acids, it has collagen boosting peptides, I think it has some vitamin C as well. It's retinol free, so it's safe to use during the day. And again, hydropeptide, all their products smell so delicious. So we're gonna do a little pump of that. Same thing, I just use the tippy tippy tops of my fingers and kind of do a little nice massage. And you can always do a little lymphatic drainage when you're doing this on yourself. You kind of want to move the fluid out and then down through the lymph here, down into your neck. Don't forget to hydrate that neck. So now my skin feels nice, plump, and hydrated. Okay. Okay, and then everybody's must do, must have thing in Florida, really anywhere, but especially Florida, is our sunscreen. So this is the Hydropeptide uh, Solar Defense Tinted. It does come in a non-tinted formula, which is great for men um, or someone that just doesn't want any color. I love this one because it gives you a little glow. It's actually got color changing spheres, so it'll sort of match your skin tone. And I'll sh sort of show you how um, the color comes off. It's not going to give you full coverage, but it'll sort of give you like a wash of color. So this one is SPF 30. It's got titan titanium dioxide, zinc oxide, acai, green tea, aloe, and hyaluronic acid. So it's great for someone that's sort of low maintenance and wants just kind of a wham, bam, SPF and moisturizer in one. 
this is the sunscreen for you. It's great, you can throw it in your beach bag, your gym bag, if you're playing tennis or golf, put this in your bag, it's amazing. So I usually do kind of two pumps of that and it comes out white, but what's so neat about it is as you kind of work it into the skin and it smells amazing, all their products smell so good. So first I kind of look like, uh-oh, kind of white, kind of that ghost look. But as you blend it in, it will start to actually match your skin tone a little bit and give you this really, really, really pretty glow. I wore this one day to work to the wellness center and you all know Gabby and I walked in and she goes, why is your face glowing? You look so good today. And I said, all I'm wearing is the solar defense. So the proof is in the pudding there. So down into the neck, you wanna make sure your neck, your ears, guys, don't forget your ears. So a little bit of glow. Now I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna wipe um, the sunscreen off of my hands on a makeup wipe so you can see that there actually is color. So I'm just wiping the excess off. A little bit that's left over and you'll see, I don't know if you can see that, there's actually kind of a tan color. So it gives you that wash of color. So can't recommend this enough. It's great. And again, it comes in a non-tinted form. So, you know, if you have one for you and then one for your husband, you throw it in your golf bag and you guys are ready to go. Okay. Um, and then two other things. So if you want kind of that lazy day look, I, th I think the SPF is great. And then I'm gonna do my brows. I've got a Jane Iredell brow pencil and I'm just gonna fill this in a little bit. Cause again, I'm gonna go run a couple errands. Gotta go dro drop something off at UPS and I don't wanna do a full face of makeup. So um, we carry all the Jane Iredell makeup and all of this stuff is gonna be available for pickup. All you have to do is call or email us and me or Gabby or someone at the Wellness Center will bag it up for you and have it ready to go. And then the last step, my favorite, favorite stuff from Hydropeptide is their Perfecting Gloss. So this gloss is not just a lip gloss, it's got hyaluronic acid, antioxidants, peptides, and it's a little bit of a plumper. So this is my favorite color. This is the Palm Springs Pink. I love it, it's like a Barbie pink. And what's great about this is it's gonna give you gloss, it's gonna give you that pretty, pretty sheen, but it's also gonna hydrate your lips. So it's like a lip treatment and gloss in one. So because this is our tester, I'm going to use my little stick, and this color is so beautiful. So it gives you the prettiest gloss and it doesn't feel sticky or tacky. It doesn't feel like you're going to eat it. It feels really silky and smooth. So super quick, super easy. All these products can be purchased. If you have any questions about any of them, let us know, reach out to us. And then later tonight, I'll do a PM routine, which is a little bit more in depth and I'll go over those products as well. We miss you guys. Stay strong, stay healthy and uh, reach out if you have any questions. Have a great day.